welcome back everyone to this tutorial where i show you step by step how you can use anything to create a ai agent which can help you to send many email automatically to your email list okay as you can see here i have many people that i want to send message i have created this agent and it helped me to do that okay i'll show you how you can create the same so let's go so how it work i will explain you how you can set up step by step the same configuration in your workflow so if you go to the home you can create let me say this you can create a new workflow by click here and you'll name it how you want be, be uh, something like that okay automation okay we'll start with a, a trigger manual trigger if you do want to click on it you'll get go there to add our google sheet okay and so let me find a google sheet here and click on a pen or update row in sheet okay so here you must create a new credential to connect your if you do go there let me delete those let me delete this and show you how you can connect you just click click on your youtube your google go to find your account and connect it and it's done okay very simple after that and uh, you have your google sheet you must upload your google sheet on your or create a google sheet with your account if i go to google sheet google sheet here and let me change this account here okay i want to go to google sheet if i go there click on google sheet okay here i can create a new google sheet or oh, i will create a new and i must found register in my tally i have many 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 uh, subscribers okay so i want to copy and have integrated with a google sheet here so i can go to this sheet i copy uh, some i copy some uh, some gmail here and go to my google sheet my new google sheet and paste it here so i have submit a time submit time the full name email uh, the type of pc because i have get those by my, my form this form i have created to allow people from my tiktok to submit for a uh, AI calls okay so I will use some that are here maybe I want to this is our mail okay list mail list and if I go to my workflow I, I must just change name let me add name email list for test okay I want to send information to this let me place it here okay in my workflow if i click here first select get row click here and find email list for test okay it's the same name and choose sheet one okay and finish okay here we can if we execute if if we click on test we'll uh, get all mail from this list okay we have 40 list 40 item we have 40 and uh, 50 email here okay we have get 50 email so now you want to add a loop with a law house to get all email and send information okay must delete this and delete this and here we want to add a set because we want to it is filled we want to get data from our email yes we want to get the submit the full name email the pc information and contact okay so 
uh, if I execute the preview new preview uh, we can find them here okay for the first you want to add this value and value add it here add it here okay do the same for all here the name and the value you know the name full name and the value okay the same do the same for email and the value okay pc type and the value contact and the value and done okay you don't need to get this you will edit it after if i click on test step we will get a simplify here we have when when we add a loop when we add a loop we have many that are after test step we get some that are here and with the set we can simplify and get only those we have we have need to continue after that we can add an agent here agent and this agent will add if you click in the bottom you can add open i chat gpt let me find chat gpt 40 and create a new cleaner cell had we, we we have seen in the last in the preview video you can check how to create a new credential it's very simple and now we want to and and here we want to add some tools first gmail we will use gmail to send information to our customers okay so here the 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 mail in the loop step you want you want to get it okay the mail in the loop step or the mail in the field okay and uh, we can get it here for the subject we can add we can get the name of the user the subscriber and say this something okay you can add any uh, subject about your your content and here we'll find uh, we'll find a code to this part okay so if you go to your chat gpt and go to write a system which is with chat gpt paste it here and set it and go there and i want paste it here and i might check it and edit it so here you have all information here okay okay nice so after that and we can add a sheet a google sheet to update our row so here you can go to choose update row and find your email list and choose a sheet and now you want to you want to select a mail and update it okay so delete this delete this delete this delete this because we have let me explain you select a mail you can add column you want to catch this row in the list and write email send it okay if the email is send it send it okay and here you want to get the mail from the loop or from the the edit field okay from the loop okay nice so after that add a gmail here after send it the mail we must get confirmation send message okay you must use my account and send me send me a message to confirm me the message is sent to followers okay and here the subject we can create a subject okay and if i 
execute preview node, you must find, let me change this below. You must go to chat GPT, create a system message and paste it here. Okay, this system message, let me find the type of PC here. You explain it, you must send message to Gmail after uh, after you after send message to customers okay put the system message here okay here you paste your system this message here you can go to uh, chat gpt explain that you want do the same shot and chat gpt will create a system message for you if i click here you can see it must uh, send message to me once the the loop is finished okay so if i test workflow i get this output okay and in the message here you must click to execute the last node okay and drag and put this output here and here you must write something confirmation mail send it to this two you must find it here you can use the loop the loop may full name okay or uh, find this edit field above wake okay and now you have configured this and after that you are ready to test the workflow okay now we must test our workflow okay i must maybe place my email list here because we want to see the process when we send, we execute this workflow. Okay, let me place it in the best position like that. Okay, now we can place our email list here. Okay. Okay, now we can, we can click on test workflow and look at the process. When an email is sent, it, we get a confirmation in the in the sent row email send it. Okay, for the for the second we have another confirmation email send it, the third and so on. Okay, the AI agent go to the loop, get the email in the loop, use email to send message, and after go to Google Sheet to to add email send it in the confirmation row okay and he repeat this action go to the loop get an image the next image okay from the sheet use gmail to send my information i have configured about my new youtube and once the email is sent again you go to check send it Okay, now if we, if we go to my Gmail, because the first Gmail, okay, the first Gmail here is for me. So I can go to check if I have received the email, okay? And let me check. Okay, this is the mail here. If I do one click, I can see the mail with information about the new content, new cows, alert, alert. If I do one click, I can get access to my YouTube where I've post my new content video about AI, which can and and manage your store and answer to customers. Okay, so this process will continue because we have many mail to send a message. Okay this process will be continued until it finished to send message to all gmail here okay once it's finished to send me the the last to send the last email okay you go there to send me confirmation okay this is how you you configure it your ai agent to send message to send automatically information about your content to email list by using anything so see you to the next video